bottom of the bracket, SMU a very good team. There's not a reasonable person in America that believes, based upon numbers, UCLA belongs in the field of 68. They are 2-8, and 2-8 eight, and eight against the field. All right, guys. Uh, they, 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 they beat Utah once at home. That's what they're hanging on to. UCLA safely in is a joke to me. It makes absolutely no sense based upon what you said previously. They honor road wins. Who'd they beat on the road? Yeah. They got beat by a million at Utah. Stanford's the best road win. Well, and Stanford's not in the field, so right. that, that's not considered a great road win. They had seven points at the half against Kentucky, and you can talk around all you want about Kentucky being more advanced, but seven points? UCLA does not belong in this field. So, Scott, help me out with this. I respect your basketball opinion and your eyes as a former basketball player yourself and as a sitting athletic director at Utah State, but when did you see UCLA that leads you to believe they were safely in the field considering if you value road games, 40 points essentially, they were beaten by Utah down the road from you in Salt Lake, 18 points by Oregon. Uh, they only played Arizona twice, lost to them both times. Why is UCLA so safely in this field when numerically they don't, they don't appear in? And by the eye test, yeah, I struggle to put them in.